you can use your USB stick memory here go to file tab I'm gonna find the file that I need to face the setup jig which is in my case is under mold here and you use to move this NGC folder which is our working folder here to load the file you can double click it or you can use load G code I double click it shows up on this side here you can edit the file on the edit tab here and you can then save also you can see the plot on the plot tab you hit perspective and you can zoom in and out you can use your mouse and left and right buttons to rotate and pan and then I usually like to go to DRO tab so I can see these coordinates with larger fonts let me talk about a little bit about our pendant here okay so you need to press XYZ or at the same time if you can if you know uh, where it's moving so Y and this is the when you turn it clockwise is positive and counterclockwise is negative and it has, it has several stages speed stages and for really small movements you have the middle dial here so I'm gonna move this back set object installation I'm using two bolts right now you can also use three on the center now we gonna make it get it ready for facing so once I'm kind of there for X and Y I go to the screen here and have zero on both X and Y I could put other numbers here but right now I'm looking for zero so X zero Y zero and I'm gonna go to DRO so I can see those numbers better now we're gonna go to and touch off Z um, you can use a piece of paper and move it down until I'm using the pendant to slowly move it down and I release it up until I get my paper back So I know that piece of paper was six thousandths of an inch and I want to add a little bit more to face it so I'm gonna go ten thousandths here okay 
Now we're going to run the program. I can either hit R on the keyboard or I can hit run cycle on the screen. It is going to go for the tool change position first. Since it is the same tool as it's on the machine, it's going to start right away. <laughs> 